and a hardline former security chief has been installed as the new leader of Hong Kong. John Lee won the approval of around 1,400 pro-Beijing members of a closed election committee. He was the only candidate on the ballot. Lee oversaw a crackdown on the territory's democracy movement. He will now replace outgoing leader Carrie Lam in July. International observers fear Lee's election will further tighten Beijing's grip on Hong Kong. And earlier, I asked our correspondent in Hong Kong, Phoebe Kong, uh, what people there make of the territory's new leader. Well, this is the vote counting center where John Lee was just officially selected as Hong Kong's next chief executive. So um, uh, he, he was uh, a very highly uh, controversial political figure in Hong Kong uh, who oversaw the crackdown on Hong Kong's uh, 2019 very massive anti-government protest. And also he was a key figure uh, to execute Beijing's national security law in Hong Kong by uh, arresting uh, numerous opposition figures and silencing uh, many uh, independent media organizations. So um, he has earned a reputation as a hardliner and that also makes him like kind of unpopular among the general public according to the popularity ratings figures that we have like observed throughout the past few years. So although John Lee has managed to secure 99% uh, of the support votes to, in this election, there is only like less than uh, 1,500 uh, members of um, like of the election committee members can vote today, which is only 0.02% of the population. So uh, outside the polling station, outside vote counting center, uh, like outside Hong Kong on the streets, uh, we can feel a sense of indifference from the general public that many people we have spoken to said uh, they don't care about the election or they have no expectation in the next leader because simply they don't have a say on this, um, who the next leader will be. It was DW correspondent Phoebe Kong speaking to me earlier.